Thank you very much for following the series of these videos in the, uh, uh, creating and allocating um, and the sharing uh, videos on Moodle learning management system. Uh, we are in video number four right now. And uh, on this video, I'm going to show you briefly on how to share your videos on YouTube privately if you wish to share them not directly on, on Moodle, but you wish, would wish to share them to first um, share them or, or store them on uh, on YouTube. Then you later have to then you later have to share them then on your site. So once you you first have to log in on on if you have a Google account, then you obviously have a YouTube account. Your YouTube account is the same as your Google account. So if you are logged into Google, then you, you can just uh, go to YouTube and then you choose the create buttons that will come here once you are, you are on YouTube. So once you click on create, then it will, you have the option to upload videos. You click on upload videos. Then you need then to select the files. You can drag and drop or you can select files. Let me just select files. Um, but it's open on the other screen here. So just locating my files quickly. I've shared them in a folder called Moodle Certification Training. I'll start with the first one. So I will have to title this one. I think this is the one that that has to do with um, mixing and editing videos. Okay, I, I, I will have a chance to add the details and so on and so on. But for the purpose of this uh, demonstration. I'll, I'll skip okay and i say this is not for kids and um i'll then say there are no age restrictions and then i just need to confirm a few things just click next i can also choose to add all the other uh, subtitles and the um, other things but for the purpose of this I will just uh, proceed. Okay, you will notice that YouTube, before uploading any video, they will have to check the video against copyright issues. Okay, so they will look at the metadata of the video, and if they found out that the video is subject to copyright, then they might not, they might refuse to upload it. But since this is my own video, surely it will pass the test. I'm um, just keeping finger crossed that it will not take 10 minutes. It can usually take uh, less than 10 minutes. Yeah, also take note, just as they caution here to say um, your video might pass this test of copyright content not found, but uh, issue might come up, maybe somebody else will watch the video and find out that you have shared a video which is not yours and which is uh, subject to copyright, then you need to, you, you have to be answerable for that. I just uh, click next, but the checks will be going on on the background. So then, this is where I want to draw your attention, okay? So I want to say this is this is only available to me and the people that I share, I choose to watch the video. So if you put the video on the public, then it will be available to everybody. But this is the video that I'm, 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 I'm still working on. So I wouldn't want to share them with everybody. I would just want to share them with the small group, okay? I will share them privately. So... Um, I then have to click next. So uh, YouTube will not make this video available to everybody. So I'll, I'll, it will be private and I'll have the privilege to share the video. 
you will notice that I have a lot of other videos um, that I created before on Moodle. Um, um, but let me just upload a couple more video. Um, so I'll need to go through the process of create again, and then I'll need to upload the video. This is the one that I uploaded. Let me upload this one as well. With a fitting title. Since this is the introductory one, uh, it will go through the same process. I was, this is not for kids. And then uh, it will be, I'll skip this. Okay, they will check it on the background, but I'll go next. I'll say this is private, and then I save. All right, so. Um, so that I don't make this video too long, I will not add all the other videos. I will, I will, I will add the other videos um, at a later stage. But in the meantime, I would just want to. Um, I think this this have this will suffice on the on the ways how to share your videos, or rather how to upload your videos on privately on YouTube, so that you will be able to share them later. So in the next. Uh, video we will then look at how do we share your videos from YouTube into Moodle.